I was talking to uh, the owner of a small business, and he expressed some dissatisfaction with his employees. He said, I'm really frustrated because I set up this 401k plan for them. I wanted them to have more financial security, and in fact, I, I set up what I thought was a pretty generous match. My memory is that it was an 8% match, a pretty big deal, and yet people just weren't participating. And he said he'd bug them about it, and he would send the reminders, and, and it would move the needle a little bit, but not very much. And so he was frustrated, and one December, he called an all-hands meeting, and it wasn't that big of a company, maybe 100, 150 people, and they all piled into the same room, and he was the last person to walk in, and he walked in without a word, carrying this big, heavy-looking medical bag. And he walked over to the conference table in the middle of the room, and without saying a word, he unzipped the bag, turned it upside down, and out piled a huge amount of cash on the table. Picture it, you know, a huge stack of cash on the table just laying there. And so naturally, people got curious at that moment. What is going on here? What's the cash? And he said, take a good look at this. He said, this is the amount of money that all of you left on the table. And I mean this literally, left on the table by not maxing out your 401k contributions. He said, at the end of this meeting, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to scoop this money back in this bag. I'm going to zip up the bag, and I'm going to take it back to my bank, and I'm going to deposit it into my account. He said, we're going to do this little ceremony again next year, next December, on this same day. And my question to you is, do you want this cash next year in your pocket or in mine? He said there was a rush to sign up for the 401k plan that day. Now, isn't that interesting? Right? Nothing's really changed about the fundamentals here. Nothing's changed about the value proposition of a 401k, but the method of presentation made it come alive. It's so tempting when you're a small business owner or someone in this situation to get caught explaining things. Right? Here's how you sign up for a 401k, right? Here's why you should sign up for a 401k. Here's the magic of compound interest. But he observed that didn't work. It was too dry. It was too abstract. What he discovered is that moments are messages. Moments are messages. 